Hey, what's up guys? Are you guys ready? Let's go. What's up Brownstown? It's your boy Andre from Browns Professional Carpet Care. You're tuned in to today's whew, vlog. All right guys, on the schedule today we have, on the list we have carpet cleaning and tile and grout cleaning for today guys, on today's vlog. So I hope you guys are ready for it. I'm excited to get to use the X, the SX-15 uh, tile and grout machine. Also, you know, I'm starting with the workhorse to get the carpets done. Two rooms of carpet and the kitchen area for carpet cleaning. All right, so let's go in, take a look at what we got to do, and let's get on to the vlog, guys. I'm about to get started, guys. So today, carpet cleaning, tile and grout. Got one of my sealer doors up here, and another sealer door. Back here, and we're about to go in and get it started, guys. premium package on these two floors that you've seen and also tile and grout clean up all right so let me get some pictures and i'm going with the pre-vacuum guys workhorse empty canister make sure everything is correct all right so my workhorse wasn't pulling out but i have never changed this right here and this thing is clogged up in here guys so i i took the back I took this one out to check to make sure this was good. The attachment hose was actually working perfectly and it was making the tunnel spin. So something just told me, let's look up here, see what other hoses there are. Look at that, guys. You can't really see, but it's, it's debris inside of here. Look at that, guys. You can replace that off. Look at that. Holy moly. Look at that, guys. Holy moly. Look at this. Look at that. Holy crap, guys. Oh, yeah, this is so clogged. I'm glad I checked this. Hmm. Look at that, guys. Holy moly, guys. That's why maintenance is very good for your machine, and I have never took this hose off. Now, I'm glad that I've seen that because I will definitely start cleaning that weekly. Wow. Look at all this. Look at this, guys. Holy crap. No wonder. Man, holy moly, I gotta get something to push this. Look, look at this, guys. What the world? Holy moly. This little piece right here was clogged, guys. Whoa, so this was just a break. Whoa, I'm gonna get all this out, but guys, then I'm gonna vacuum it all up. Look at this, guys, this is crazy. Guys, if you have problems with your workhorse, as far as, or any type of vacuum cleaner, check these hoses out, guys, because, oh my goodness, look at that. Clear pathway now, clear pathway. All right, guys, so let me get this workhorse started and vacuum this stuff up.
this. Hey, this workhorse is incredible, guys. It's working like it never did before, guys. I knew over the last couple days my workhorse wasn't seeming to work as good as it normally did. And now I understand why, guys. So, let's see what this is gonna pick up. See where it's at. Let's go.
Okay, just finished two rooms, guys. Holy moly. Gotta shake that down some, guys. Holy moly. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. Look at that canister, guys. Oh. Holy moly, guys. Look at that. Holy moly. Ooh. Guys. So over the last couple of jobs, my workhorse has been picking up like a half of this, guys. So now that I know what is what was wrong with it, I know the sounds of the workhorse now that I can easily hear if it's a, a clog problem, which I didn't know at first. So I'm happy that I figured it out today and fixed it. I want to go back to that job when I just did that um that workhorse video that I just released, guys, with that pink carpet. I know I could have got two canisters out now, guys. Holy moly. So I'm going to go on and get the cleaning agent, uh, agitation with the CRB, rinsing, and then I'm going to hit the actual tiling route floors, guys. Whoa.
have one more step to go. One more step to go. Looking better already. One more step to go, guys. One more step to go. But they're coming out better already, guys. A lot better already. Let's get ready for extraction and rinse. In this situation here, guys, as you can see, there's still some um, fiber damage. As you can see, the discoloration. Uh, with the heavily soiled traffic areas, you can't clean wear and tear, guys. But in this situation, as you can see, uh, the carpets came out better, but you can still see some of that brown area, which is fiber damage. See still some uh, fiber damage right here. But if I get closer, it's not as dark as it looks. But uh, overall, came out great. Mine is that heavily traffic area and fiber damage right there. But other than that, it came out a lot better than the day before, guys. As you can see some more fiber damage here, discoloration. And let's go to the next room. Town. Yes, my glove is ripped. I just did not feel like taking it off or replacing it. <laughs>
Downs Town. We're all finished. Let's go in and take a look at the flo tile floors. You guys already seen the carpet. The drought. They came out great, guys. Beautiful. Hit the thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button right now.